What's up everyone, Willie Apple here, and today Apple has released the 8th beta of iOS 18 to developers and public beta testers. In this video, I'll be showing you what is new inside the software. This update is bigger than beta 7, and I'll be showing you what is new right now. The first one has to do with Spotlight Search. If you were to search up settings, for example, and a couple other app icons down here, these are now dark mode icons. Before these would just be light mode icons. Dark mode icons are coming in more places now, especially in Spotlight Search. They're all just dark now, including the smaller icons. Now, next thing inside this latest beta of iOS 18, also inside of Spotlight Search, is first of all, this icon down here is now dark with the general icon right here, and that we have the same description that we have right here. This one right here, basically, I think they're the same. Oh no, they're not. But it just gives you a different description of it, and it's just really nice that we have the little text out that explains what the section does. Now, I'm not sure who would be searching general or privacy and security, but that has been found inside this latest beta of iOS 18. Now, I did say iOS 18 beta 7 felt like a final release, and I had to back that up with iOS 18 beta 8, because this feels even better than beta 7. I personally cannot wait for iOS 18 to release to everyone. iOS 18.0 felt like an iOS 17.0, and then when we got more and more betas, it just got smoother over time, except for beta 2, I'm talking to you. And this was an unexpected beta, because Mark Gurman actually said that this was supposed to be the final beta. Fortunately, we got this beta to talk about. Now, what is next for Apple? So I have this interactive calendar right here so we can take a look to see. Let's go to today. Today is Wednesday the 28th, and I do not expect anything to come next week. I feel like this is going to be the final beta, unless there's some major issue that comes out, then Apple will definitely need to address that. Now we could potentially get watchOS tomorrow, maybe an Xcode beta tomorrow, since we did not get those today. And maybe we can get another 18.1 beta since we did get those as well, but I highly doubt that. And then uh, for sure we're getting the RC on the 9th right here, unless Apple goes completely haywire with a different schedule. But yeah, that is what to expect within the next software updates. As for final release, I'm gonna take a wild guess and say it's the 16th, most likely on the 16th right here. Apple loves the Monday public releases lately, so I'm saying the 16th. Anyways, that is everything that is new inside this latest beta of iOS 18. It's shaping up to be a stable release and a really nice release with a lot of significant new changes, including RCS, moving icons to the bottom, dark mode icons, and a lot more. Thanks for watching. Comment, like, subscribe, share it with your friends. Download my apps in the description down below, and I'll see you in my next video. Bye!